Hello guys and welcome to another Drive Club video this week. We're going to be playing the Photo Finish DLC. So let's jump right where we left off, which it seems we left off on Valley Drift, I want to say. Yeah, but it shows we already got stars for this. So I'm just going to go with Valley Drift. Even if we already did Valley Drift, we didn't get no stars for it. So let's just jump right into that. Always love drifting on this game if it's the right car. In this situation, I'm going to choose Maserati. Mainly because it has a lot of, um, you know, rear wheel drive type power. You know, a lot of power going to the back wheels. With that from Romero, it's kind of short. Even though it would go sideways a lot quicker, um, I'm just not going to take a chance with it. I'm going to try to do a, a weight transfer on this car. Oh, a weight transfer drift. Well, let's see. Oh, I couldn't make it leak. I didn't use no handbrake either there. Let my no handbrake. Oh, shit. Because I didn't know my button for the handbrake. I pressed a different button. I didn't get no points for that. Yeah, that's my handbrake. Always used to R1 being my handbrake, circle being my handbrake, it's a little weird. That was a pretty good drift. Yeah, I think we're gonna have to redo this one because that, that point where we didn't get no points, we should get points here. Yep, seems we didn't get the. We're so close to the one star, so let's uh let's rerun that one more time. Let's see if we can get a little better. Which I'm, I mean, if I can just get points on that second one, the one we messed up on, I'll be good. This time I'm gonna try to link that drift a lot better. So let's go. God, I don't know what the hell that was. I'm just doing donuts because I can. <laughs> so I believe we got the one star. I'm good with that. If we do need more stars, we can just come back and redo redo those events and get it that way. So so far we have four. We need to get four more to unlock the second part. So it seems we have another drift right here. Freaking awesome. I love drifting. Oh, the oh, if you remember our older videos, this car, it beat the shit out of me. It beat the shit out of me many times. This car is crazy in power. So me and, I, I, I mean, I could probably drift it with all that power. It's just to be held to control it. You know, it's control the drift. It's not all about all this power to the rear I mean you still have to control that car it's like taking you know like people that take a 240 and put a V8 motor in it I mean yeah it's a good idea but that thing's gonna be out of hand <laughs> yeah, I thought this car was a lot faster than this this thing's fucking electric I must have forgot this car I thought this thing was like super fast with crazy oh it is fast okay it's just it's electric electric drifting that's a first for me so quiet. I don't know what to do. I don't know if I'm driving or or what. I, I couldn't hear the car. So yeah, this car is not the car I'm thinking of. But uh, yeah. 
Let's run with that one more time, because like I said, I think I can do better. I was so confused and not here in my car, so I didn't know, do I throttle control? What's going on here? <laughs> I mean, look at this thing. This thing, I mean, it builds up some speed pretty quick, but goddamn, it's quiet. better or worse oh no we still have that uh one star so let's go with that so this is two races um um uh, it's six stars i do a lot here but we'll get it out of the way so which car should I pick? Now, they recently added this car, the Gatham R500 Superlight. Since I haven't drove it yet, what I can remember, I don't remember driving it. Uh, let's jump into that and let's let's run this. I remember this car from Sega GT. It actually, was the fastest car on Sega GT. Uh, this thing can get out of hand. Uh, it it can, you know, it's little. It's 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 light. It can slip out of your hands real quick, and it's probably gonna get pushed around by the other bigger cars, all the other Britain slash Germany monsters. But you know, we'll get through there with the little guy. Oh, I feel so weird. All the way down here. So low to the ground. I like this car. I like the sound. Motor just winding up the RPMs. Tacking out of the straightaways. This car does not have long gears. Sometimes you, you have to do that. Don't you, even though you, you hear your car shift, it don't mean you have to shift out right in there. Because if you come into a turn, you might just leave it in that gear and take that turn in that gear. Most people just upshift, downshift, upshift. There's too much shift. We're halfway through this race. So far, so good. But you know how it goes. I can easily lose what I have in a second. Brakes light up, light up. That dude's like hard braking over there, man. You always want to stay true to your line. Never follow their line. Never, you know, if you see you're close to them, never race your opponent. Always focus on what you're doing. If you follow your line and race your own race, you'll just, you know, pass them up. Gotta look for you. Gotta look for you. Point to pass somebody. Oh, 
this this thing. I want to follow that line as much as I can. I don't get that. I am not going to get it, but at least I tried. A little bit of easy star from it, far as. So we got a third place finish. I'm pretty happy with that. Podium's always good if I can keep it. Oh no! <laughs> No, yes, look at that, fourth place, that dude took our star from us, he stole our star, right at the end, that was beautiful, <laughs> it really was beautiful, man, <laughs> and I saw him, I tried blocking, I was like, nah, I can't do it, he had me. We have to beat that guy up there for sure. We'll go star for just beating him. Tell you what, if there's a lot of corners like that and not a lot of straightaways on this track, that'll be good. This car is not built for straightaways. Save it, save it. There we go. Slow in, fast out. Now you gotta take these turns. I'm so scared right now, I just don't want to fuck up. <laughs> Dude, seriously? Just run into me? Wow, y'all some bitches. Boom! Did I get two stars for that? I don't even know if I got first on that. I just kept my ground. I didn't let nobody push me around. And I got first! Yes! Yes! Oh, we got two stars with that. Look at that. That, that was a perfect race. You know, I kept my cool through it all. And that was, that was awesome. And we leveled up to level 20. That is cool. And we have another Aster Morn. There might be a whole bunch of Aster Morns in this game because I think we've been getting Aster Morns like crazy and we got a Pagani or Pagani or Pagani or Pagini. I don't know what it's called, but that thing looks beautiful. We have enough stars and we're moving on to the next thing. That's awesome. So yeah, guys, we have these events left in the photo finish series. 
I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, leave a like and share, and I'll see y'all next episode.